hello guys and welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel hello and welcome to my channel my name is summer so uh, people have asked my opinion about this uh, there's a content uh, creating couple on facebook that they they called aisha and odogu or odogu and aisha so i can't i don't know which is which but uh, apparently i think the man is a comedian and I'm not too sure what the wife does but basically they are content creators on facebook there's been a lot of content they've been creating that they are falling out and they have issues and all of that um you know uh, and all of that and people oh what do you think what do you think i didn't know about this couple until this whole thing i didn't honestly i didn't know about this couple until this uh thing started happening so i'm saying that now in case somebody says, oh did you not know that so so and so i honestly didn't know until this right so now um the, and i went to the platform right i found one one page that says um aisha and odogu fan or lovers or something like that that's the name of the page and apparently i can't find another page i think that's the page they run but they call it that right and then there's one that is the man the man um um that is odogu comedy or something like that but it's a comedy page for the man right and when I looked at the so-called misunderstanding in their marriage, I'm going to be 100% honest with you guys. Um, I do not think they have any misunderstanding. From what I saw, they are a couple simply creating content. And they are giving you guys the kind of content you guys like. They have come to see that drama pays more than any other thing. And they are basically cashing out. That's what I saw. Because the so-called the origin of the fight, the one that I saw, you know, uh, these two elderly women came from the village and they said, this child is your husband's child. And they, if you look at that, you can tell he's acting. You can tell. And let me tell you guys, I have no, nothing against this couple cashing out. When I want content, did they give on a content? And what I believe is this. We all know of a couple that uh, came out, uh, the man came out and said, my wife was unfaithful. I don't want to go into all their names or whatever. You know, we all know of a couple that has been on trending for almost a year or more than a year now, simply because they brought, or the man brought a family drama public. And, uh, and that couple, they cashed out big time. You know, their followers grew, money grew, everything grew. So why will another couple not sit back and strategize and say, let's do a drama? To build our family income. Why not? If they are creating other content. Now they watch sometimes. I know they watch sometimes. But they see how another couple have trended. For over a year. Over falling out. Why they not go on cash out on that? Why would they not want to cash out on that? That's what I saw. Let me tell you guys. A couple is falling out. And every time. And they are still running the same. <laughs> they are still running the same Facebook page. You will see the man come out and say. Eh. So, 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 so. on the same facebook page he's doing a live video and he's speaking so he still has access to login right after he has and he will rant and rant and rant and complain and complain and say whatever he wants to say the next one hour or whatever the wife will come on the same page they're still running the same page ah uh -uh, come on guys use your bro. use our let's use our brains the couples they are big the couple they are basically just creating content. I saw the one where they said they went to their um, the elders and they were having a meeting. And you can tell there was so much acting going on. I'm Igbo. And I know how meetings of elders go. Not be so it be. There is a the feel is the vibe is different. Seven of say the difference is clear. Your bow will say yatowa. Igbo will say here the There is it. I know what a family meetings look like. What I saw that day was a content until today and they, they they started trending aisha and um and Odogu. they are trending so people are creating content about them talking about them that is what did a lot of let me tell you guys when you people reward a couple for their marriage breaking up when i say reward you are always feasting on their content you are always there taking sides i support the man i support the woman and you help the couple to trend for over a year why would it not be juicy? Why would the idea not be juicy for another couple to say, ah, let's try to fall out. Let's build our page. Let's make money from it. They broke up. Oh, when the wife does a live video on their main page, the man shares it on his comedy page. What are you doing? He's sharing their content. These people are, let me tell you guys, they are smart. They are basically creating content. Guess what I even saw? 
<laughs> Funny enough, I say sometimes when I may want to make a, a content, something now comes to say, it happens to me a lot that I'm planning a content. I will now like come across something else. I will actually add to what I wanted to say. Today now I was on Facebook. I saw the, um, the family they call the KO family. I've covered the story about them once or twice, I think twice, about the way they adopted the girl that the father, a lot of you may know the story, I'll put a link if I remember, you know, they adopted this girl, the girl's mother is gone, as in she's no longer with us, she's no longer alive, and the father does not have custody or something like that. This couple, KO family, you know, they took this girl in and the girl's biological father is coming and, you know, that's how I got to know about them, this particular couple, the, um, the KO family. And I saw a page, I said, ah, when I even saw this video at first, I thought, ah, did somebody steal their content and upload it? Because he said something, uh, I can't remember the name I saw on. <laughs> the funny thing is that all these things these people are doing, right now, even me, I'm helping their ministries. <laughs> I'm helping, because I'm telling you the name of the pages and everything. My, I don't mind. I don't mind helping their ministry. It's for them to make income, cash out from people liking drama, to feed their families or whatever. You see, content creation, eh? Anybody can decide to make anything a content. And it is about the supply, uh, how do you say, it's about uh, supply and demand, be demand and supply. You guys, most people out there like drama. And the couple, well, like, right now, the KO family, if I forget, the man I created the content. I saw him. He said, I'm not eating for how many days? When I tell my wife to forgive me, I was like, hey, hey una too? They have said creating content that they have fallen out. In their own case now, the man now went to a different page altogether that they have. Not the KO family one. He now says she logged me out. At least they even do their own say, claiming that they logged him out. He said they log she logged him out of uh, their KO family group uh, page, blah, blah, blah. And he's begging. Oh, help me beg my wife. Blah, blah. They started the drama too. The drama pays. It pays. I have not eaten for how many days. Come to think of it. For it to have been suggested in my... What's that called now? To have been suggested in my... Um, what's it called? News feed. I'll be... Facebook feed, you know what I mean? It's working already. I've never seen this their page before. But now they started the drama. It appeared on my on my feed because now Facebook is boosting their uh, their kidney is getting boosted by drama. Let me tell you guys my opinion, and I believe, I believe, is the hundred percent truth. I believe, I believe that Odogu and his wife are just acting. They are just a lovely couple. Who create content and they see that people love drama and they see how viewers have rewarded other people that brought drama on facebook uh, bought drama on facebook on social media and they want to cash out on it this couple have not broken up they say they broke up and they are still staying in the same house they are still even every time they come and they say this one ah come on guys when i look through their videos and the contents they've created all i saw is just uh, acting for the views the views for the money are they committing a crime? Nope. Are they cashing out? Yes. Are they smart? Yes, they are. Don't forget, like I said, it's about demand and supply. Viewers like drama. And this couple are simply supplying you guys what you are demanding. One of the things I noticed about Facebook, I, I'm not, I wouldn't be a Facebook person, I'm a YouTube person. And I will tell you guys, Facebook and YouTube are not the same. I, I, let me put it this way. I think there is more... I prefer YouTube any day, any time. When I say YouTube, the viewers, I see more maturity. And people, from my experience, people that are actually interested in the message or lessons we can learn, or, you know, adult communication, like communicate like adults and, you know, you know, uh, whatever. Typically, go on Facebook. Facebook is, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm no, no, no. What I see on Facebook, I was like, no. I was like, what? Com That's why some people, they thrive on Facebook. But on YouTube, their content is not flying. It's not really selling. Because YouTube is, is different. In a way, it is different. There's some kind of dramas they are doing. When they bring it on Facebook, you know they sell. No, I have covered some stories there concerning a couple drama or whatever. And my typical way of creating content is, um, I, be, I try to be honest. I try to balance it and say, okay, no, what this person is doing is wrong. And what that person is doing is, as well is wrong. I, 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 I try not to be biased about my opinion. But when I drop some of my contents on Facebook and I saw this will annoy a lot of them not all don't always get me right well as I say all but the majority of them on Facebook they're not interested in what are the lessons to learn what is there to grab from it or what is the myth no they are just interested in drama nothing else when I say drama empty dramas that they gain absolutely nothing from 
I'm telling you, they have no interest in, you know, intellectually lifting themselves up. I made a few content here, being honest. I don't believe in, oh, choose side and stick with it. No. I say the truth. Oh, you, this one is right. Oh, that one is wrong. This one, oh, this one is wrong and this one is wrong too. When I saw the way they behave there, I just said, no. I left it because that's not my side of social media. I'm not interested in drama. I'm not interested in all those emptiness. And I don't want to be linked with some of this kind of ghetto behavior or stuff like that. And I, and I left it. Going back to this couple. So KO family now have fallen out, Abby, as well. Then Aisha and her husband are doing couple uh, drama too, uh, whatever. And it's selling. And I have looked at it and I would say it again. This is my opinion. Those that are asking me my opinion, my opinion is this. Aisha and uh, Odogu are two smart people. They have seen what viewers like and they are giving viewers what they like so they can create content that the viewers would watch, that they will get a lot of views and then they will get a lot of money. They are cashing out and I just think they are just being very smart. And uh, as far as I know, it's not a crime. <laughs> and as far as I know, they have not committed any crime. They're just being smart. And uh, apparently, like I said, uh, KO family have actually uh, joined. And I'm hoping, to be honest with you, I'm hoping more people will come out and do more marriage drama. Or these Facebook people, since people prefer drama, give them more drama. Let them watch drama. We have Odogu and uh, Aisha, and then we have uh, KO family have joined. I beg more people, feel free to join because that is the trending content on Facebook. Join and make your legit. It's legit now. Nah? Is there a crime there? I beg join and make your legit income and feed your families. Since that's what people want, give them what they want. But please go ahead, continue to give them drama, let them enjoy. And you guys enjoy the financial aspect. Uh, that's how I feel about it. As always, whatever your opinions are, please feel free to leave them uh, in the comment section below. And with that, I'm going to say thank you for watching. Until the next time, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.